please subscribe and you can download this code from description below. Certainly. Below is a comprehensive tutorial on mapping a list to another list in Python, along with code examples and explanations. Mapping lists in Python involves applying a function to each element of a list and generating a new list from the results. This is commonly done using tools like list comprehensions, the map, function, or more recently, using Python's Lambda functions or the func tools library. List comprehensions offer a concise way to apply an operation to each element of a list and create a new list from the results. The map function in Python applies a given function to each item of an iterable, like a list, and returns an iterator that yields the results. Lambda functions are small, anonymous functions. They can be used as a concise way to define simple functions for mapping operations. Mapping lists in Python is a fundamental operation that allows you to transform data in one list into another based on specific functions or operations. Python provides multiple ways to perform list mapping, including list comprehensions, the map, function, and lambda functions. Understanding these methods gives you flexibility and readability in your code when manipulating lists in Python. ChatGPT Mapping one list to another in Python involves applying a function or operation to each element in the source list and creating a new list that contains the results. This is commonly done using a list comprehension, the map, function, or a simple for loop. In this tutorial, we'll explore various ways to map one list to another, along with code examples for each approach. List comprehensions provide a concise way to create a new list by applying an expression to each item in an iterable. Here's how you can map one list to another using a list comprehension. In this example, we've defined a square function to square each element in the source list. The list comprehension iterates over the source list, applying the square function to each element, and stores the results in result underscore list. The map function is a built-in Python function that applies a given function to each item of an iterable, example a list, and returns an iterable, usually a map object. To convert the result to a list, you can use list. In this example, we use the map function to apply the square function to each element in the source list. We then convert the map object to a list to get the final result. You can also map one list to another using a for loop by iterating through the source list and appending the results to a new list. In this approach, we create an empty list, result underscore list, and use a for loop to iterate through the source list, applying the square function to each element and appending the results to result underscore list. Choose the method that suits your needs and coding style. List comprehensions and the map function are generally more concise and Pythonic, while using a for loop gives you more control and flexibility when mapping lists. ChatGPT